good morning, morning, everybody, and welcome to the latest episode of Vincent Vision. We just gotta say it, right? We are going on a Disney cruise. Woo! <laughs> Spring break. Woo! It's gonna be great. It's a lot of fun. We are so so excited to do this. This is my first ever cruise. Um, this is your first ever Disney cruise? Yes. I've heard nothing but great things about the experience, so we're excited as first time Disney cruisers to take you guys along with us. We are here, it is day one, expect multiple vlogs for this adventure, but we are actually getting ready to head over to the Port of Miami where we are gonna get on the Disney Dream. That is our four night cruise. We are right now at our hotel. We drove here the day before. We're at the EB Hotel, which is one of Disney Cruise's recommended hotels to stay at if you're staying here. The room is super big. Um, really, really spacious, really nice tall hotel place. room. Tall, big, big. Uh, it's like really big room. The hotel is very clean, very luxurious feeling. I would totally recommend it if you're looking to like get to Miami the day before. If you don't live in state like we do, the airport, the Miami airport, right across the street. Yes, yeah, how could I forget to mention? Yes. It is literally right across the street from the airport, which is perfect for those travelers who are flying into Miami. But we drove and we are ready to have an awesome Disney cruise. We really enjoyed our quick stay here, but now it's time for the main event. We're gonna head over to the Port of Miami and get ready to board the Disney Dream. Woo! Woo! Another really nice thing about the EB Hotel is that it actually partners with Disney. So they actually have a shuttle that drops you off at the port. There are a lot of people staying at our hotel right now who are going on what's probably the same cruise as we are. So it's a really nice service if you need it, but I am happy to just have our car because we can just drive ourselves over there. Yeah. Boom! We got all of our Disney gear packed for this cruise. Oh my gosh, we are on the top floor of the garage and there she blows. <laughs> wow, look at that. That is our Disney dream for four nights. This is amazing. The weather's amazing. Ellison, you're amazing. The city of Miami is amazing as well behind you. I and mean, yeah, what a beautiful day to go on a cruise, don't you think? I know, isn't it awesome? It's a really great city. I'm, I'm happy I, I grew up here and lived here. officially checked in. This process was insanely smooth and very efficient. They know what they're doing. They got everyone lined up with numbers. Very smooth process. Let's go! <laughs> Party Group 6, let's go! There it is. They're painting the Disney Dream logo right now as we get ready to get on Boarding Group 6. Let's go! We don't even want to take a picture. We're just ready to get on the boat. So excited. Look, it's Mickey Mouse already. You ready? Yeah. Get us in, get us into our room. This is gonna be our stateroom 7574. This is gonna be a ocean view with a veranda. I mean, I guess all of it's an ocean view, really. Check it out. This is gonna be our room for the next couple nights out at sea. We got a, a veranda room here. This is nice. This is good. This is good for us too. That's for sure. Sleeps four. This is perfect. Ah, slides up. Oh, it's a slide. You pull it down and you slide. Okay, it's a sliding door. All right, and this is our little balcony. Really high up. I mean, yeah, like in Miami right there. That's a beautiful view, beautiful day. It's gonna be even nicer when it's all ocean. And if we need to, we can just jump onto the lifeboats. Quick, quick jump right oh, there. Wow, that's scary. I don't <laughs> <laughs> so Thank cute. you. What did we get? This is supposed to be champagne. Oh my gosh, honey bumblebee. Is that what you put on there? No, that's what it's called. It's called honey bubbles. Oh. I did not. I mean, I can call you honey bubbles if you'd like. Oh, honey bumblebee. No, no, not me. I did not do that. I was like, well, that's, that's a cool. little nickname. I pre-planned this here. I I did this online ahead before our cruise. I was able to sort of have this waiting for us in the room, so we can have some champagne to celebrate our first cruise together. <laughs> and it came with chocolates too. I didn't know it was gonna come with chocolates, or maybe I ordered them. I just didn't think about it. Oh yeah, this is like a oh, hello. This is like a double 
Oh, there's a sink here. Ah, it is the toilet over here. Two separate rooms. Now I finally feel like what it's like to be like over six feet, like to be tall. This is a little small shower, but hey, it'll be nice. And we bought loofahs. That's a pro tip I would recommend. Buy some loofahs at Walgreens or CVS before you go so you can scrub yourself with all of the body wash right over here. Those H2O products yes. before they go. So nice. Put this in your purse. No, no, <laughs> no. <laughs> this is the coolest thing we've ever done. All right, we have made it on the Disney dream. Haha, <laughs> our wonderful room. We got on the ship at about 12 o'clock and there were some things we wanted to take care of before we got to our room at 1.30. That's when the room is available. We went straight to the spa, the Senses Spa. There's a thing that we've always heard really great things about called the Rainforest Room. And we got a Rainforest Room Pass for the whole cruise. So we're gonna be able to go in and out of there throughout our time here to use their spa and their relax. And uh, I'm very excited to check that out. That was really high up on my list. We looked around a bit, explored. Uh, there's a lot to do, and this place is kind of like a maze, but we've got a couple days to get the hang of it, so I think we will. I think we're gonna be all right. There's a lot to see and do here on the ship. I'm super excited. This is going great. We're in the room now, hanging out for a little bit, relaxing until our next event, which I think is the muster station. Like we have to go to our assigned muster and, and sort of learn the safety stuff of being on the cruise ship. And then from there, uh, who knows what else will happen? Actually, no, not who knows. There's a lot of ways to find out. There is the Disney Cruise Line app. The TV in the room has a way to check times for things that are happening. And you can play movies and watch Disney shows on it. It's very, very cool. We're gonna be super, super entertained on this cruise. <sighs> oh, oh. All right, we just did our muster. Oh my God. And then we walked up from deck four to deck, deck 12, 11. 12. Deck 12, 12, so we can go see the sail away. I guess we gotta be right there. All right, we got our spot. The show's gonna happen behind us. We're gonna see Mickey, Minnie, the whole gang, and then the ship goes, and then we start. Oh my gosh, then we hit the road, or hit the waves, hit the ocean. You know what I mean. The cruise starts, we leave Miami. Who's ready for their vacation? That's what I thought. Now, I hope everyone's ready to have a great time, and one more time on the count of three. Let's get this volume up. One, two, three. All right, it's time to go sailing away. Here's the little lady with a big empty name, Minnie Mouse. Showtime, you hear that? Da, da. We're gonna start moving? Oh, it's happening, very subtly. But we are moving! Okay, now we're really moving. Oh, <laughs> this is so crazy. I love this. Are you a cruise boy now? I am a cruise boy now, for sure. Bye bye, Miami. It was nice spending a day here. A good 24 hours. Yeah. You know, I got nothing. We're just leaving it at that. <laughs> get, end video. get ready for some shopping. We want to buy all of the stuff we need, the stuff we want on our first day here. Because if something I really, really want sells out, you're not going to be able to get it on the cruise. Oh yeah, I've seen a lot of these little magnets here too. Look at these guys' magnets here. I want that, okay? Next time we do this, we need magnets. We're the first ones in the store. Woo! We're getting our loot. 
Yeah. yeah, we're already picking at it, trying to figure out, get some magnets. Uh, we love collecting pins for all the adventures that we do, so we gotta get some pins. Oh, this is cool. It's like a little paperweight with the Disney Dream. No, it's a magnet. Oh, it's a magnet. Oh, that's really cool. What we're doing, we're getting two, two hats. hats. These Nike hats that Disney has are so cool. I got one in navy, and then Ellison's got one in whites. They have a lot of new, like, 2023 merchandise. Um, and it's it's cool, but I was really hoping that I could find like a polo that just said the Disney Dream on it, but I don't think they have that, unfortunately. We'll say this is a pretty cool shirt, though. That's the ship. They do have this really cool spirit jersey. This is like Mickey on the back of the ship. I think it's called uh, the Aft. I'm not really a big spirit jersey person, so we'll just have to look at that one. Let's see. Uh, maybe they got some. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. This is pretty cool. Cruise line, sailing the dream here, and I think it's kind of new. <laughs> Look at this guy. This guy's kind of, I don't know if I, oh, he's a monkey. He's a little monkey. He's got his little ears, right? Yeah. Is that what it is? That's a monkey in a robe. Ah, a monkey in a robe. Monkey, literally a monkey in a robe. And then an elephant here with some cool sunglasses. These are the little towel animals that they make for you when you, uh, when they do housekeeping. We have yet to see one yet in person, but we will, right? What? At a towel animal. Oh, yes. We have not seen one yet. <laughs> I'm excited. It's a little cruise ship here, Disney Cruise Line. I was telling Ellison if they made uh, Disney Cruise Line Legos, I would have bought that immediately. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that would have been an instant purchase. <laughs> Bye, Minnie. Yeah. Hey, whoa, hey, great job, great job. <laughs> we are now back at our room, our lovely veranda, looking out into the freaking ocean. You can't, I mean, you can't see it on camera, but right all the way down over there is Miami. The whole city, you can see those massive buildings sun setting in that direction. I'm happy we got that veranda. Yeah, this is, oh, I still can't get over that view of Miami. Like it doesn't look real at all. This is the sparkling wine that I got for our, our, our uh, embarkation, our disembarkation. I don't know what this is. We're on the boat. We're happy to be here. We're gonna celebrate. We're taking a note from my friends Jackie and Sam. We're having a little champagne on our veranda to sort of toast and then we're gonna get ready for dinner. We've got dinner at the Royal Palace tonight. We've got the second dinner, which we've been told is good for adults. It's at 8.15, it's just the two of us. You know, let me pop this sucker open. Woo! Hey. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Spring break! Cheers to what's gonna be an amazing cruise with you. Yes. Look at Ellison looking pretty for our first dinner of the night. We are going to the Royal Palace, right? Yes. Yes. Right. Royal <laughs> Palace on the third floor. We are here in the, the main area, the hub, the, the main room, the level three of the ship. We're waiting for our dinner at the Royal Palace. It's pretty, pretty busy. It's a lot, a lot of people here. We think it's crossover between the two dinners, um, but it is also spring break, and I would be surprised if this ship is uh, almost nearly full. If not one. Yeah, a lot of kids running around. Uh, poor Donald is fighting for his life out here. Very cool, you know, there's a lot going on. Definitely uh, uh, enough to do while you're here, but we're just gonna like sit here and uh, wait for our yeah, nice little like dinner. Minutes. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna hang out. <laughs> so our first restaurant, of the cruise was the Royal Palace. This is here on the, the main entry area and it's themed to the Disney princesses. Um, it was good. It was a, a really good first cruise meal, yeah. I think. Yeah, we had a breaded brie and a potato and leek soup. Both are really good. I really like the potato leek soup. And then for our entrees, we both, both are Scott, like a steak, a filet yeah. steak. Yeah. Um, that was really good too. Came with some nice sauce. I we, love the mashed potatoes and green beans. We met our servers as well. The way the Disney dining works here, if you don't know already, is it's rotational dining. So we're gonna be eating at different restaurants pre-assigned to us already. And it's gonna be the same servers for each of our dinners, nice. with the exception of Palo. They were very fun, very nice, very friendly. Yeah. Uh, they did stump us though with a little bit of a riddle that it took us a way too long <laughs> as two adults to figure out and on their own. And we need to go back to school. <laughs> yes, yeah, yeah, but hey, we're on the cruise. We'll worry about that when we get back on land. But overall, it was a really nice dinner. I'm excited to see how all the other restaurants here differ. Right before we enter the room, we met the person that will be taking care of our room. Her name is Elsie. She was super, super sweet, super welcoming. And then we walked in and we came to our turn down service with a little Ooh, elephant. Our first one of the trip. It's a little towel elephant. With a blanket. Creep monster. <laughs> little butt. Is it an elephant? Or is it like, I think it's like a 
like a dinosaur. It's an like a brontosaurus. Let's see if but it does look like it. Here. <laughs> oh, if you glasses. put glasses, little little chocolate glasses here on the elephant, I I guess it's an elephant and not a dinosaur. Oh, look, it says oh sweet dream. dream. Sweet Disney dreams. Why'd you throw it? You I, just, throw it like I just got really excited. I couldn't control myself. I'm sorry. I like the candies, guys. Thank you. Ah! We're going to do a little more exploring of the ship. We want to see it at night. And uh, speaking of night. Okay, this is kind of kind of scary. <laughs> oh no, it's okay. This is like the, oh look at that. And the, and the blue. The, the blue, blue. And the lights. And the, and the, I guess there's some other cruise ships oh, all out yeah, in the distance over, over there. there. One over there. Oh my god. One over there. Oh look at the stars. Oh yeah, the stars. Oh, they can they even come out on Wait, the camera have, too. Have you ever seen stars like that? I don't really think oh, I have. Oh, we gotta go to the top. Let's yeah, go. yeah, we're gonna go there. Let's do it. Windy out here. In the ocean. The Who ocean is windy. Can you believe that? Let's go this way. Do <laughs> what? <laughs> You're gonna be fine. <laughs> this is, where do we? Where is it coming from? We just gotta stand behind a pillar. That's how it works. Like here. You stand here. Nope, doesn't work either. <laughs> Does that work? Okay, so we decided to come back to our room because it was like super windy out there. But it was nice to go up to the top of the ship and see everything all lit up. People are out there watching movies. They got Corella on the big old screen. I think we have a really fun couple of days coming up on the cruise and I'm excited for you guys to come along with us. But we are gonna call it a night for day one of the Disney Dream. Yeah. Right, we're very tired. We are going to <laughs> sleep the good sleep. And tomorrow we land, we're gonna wake up, we're gonna be in the Bahamas. In the sow, we're gonna see what we do. We'll see what we do. We want to go down and like look around. We'll see. We'll figure it out. Um, but you guys, it's been great. <laughs> we'll see you later and uh, bright and early. Bright and early. Bye. Thank you for watching. Wah! Wah! Wah!